the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Four fall to pieces, you took my hand. And before we draw to ruins, I mean you're wrong. Leaving a world of trouble, misery. You came to rescue me in near defeat. Seasons come and go, but not you. You're forever faithful and true. I believe in miracles and wonders. For our good night message on this Tuesday, the 13th of April, 2021. Broadcasting from the Salesian Pontifical University, Rome, Italy, by your servant Father Eustace Siame, a Salesian of Don Bosco. We listen to this encouraging message in line with the gospel passage of today entitled The Power of His Grace. Today we read from John chapter 3 verse 7b to 15. It is Nicodemus with Jesus, face to face with Jesus. And here Nicodemus is told, you have to be born anew. And being born anew is born of the spirit which blows wherever it wishes. You hear it sound, but you do not know where it comes from or where it goes. So it is with everyone who is born of the Spirit. Being born of the Spirit is by grace. It is nothing of our effort. Where you find yourself just having certain goodness in your life, it is all by the grace of God. His power, His grace is that powerful within us that we just find ourselves getting transformed towards His will. Haven't you heard it's over? The reign of terror, guilt and shame has come crashing down. There is only one God and through His only Son, and so in this regard, we listen to this poem entitled, The Power of His Grace. Haven't you heard it's over? The reign of terror, guilt and shame has come crashing down. There is only one God and through His only Son, you have been set free. Not because of the strength of your own, not because you were righteous. No, it was all because of grace. You are no longer condemned, so rejoice. But there is more, much more. You are also free from having to condemn. You don't have to. You can't. You have been forgiven much. So begin to forgive. You can still set limits and boundaries. Don't expose yourself to pointless harm. But don't harden your heart. Before God, we are all equal and all guilty. Before God, we can stand with confidence when washed clean by the blood of the Lamb. The power of His grace makes your heart strong instead of condemnation. Bring patience, compassion and mercy. Love until it hurts. Show your wounds to Christ and He will heal you with His. Be Christ on the earth. May His kingdom reign forever. He gives more grace when the burdens grow greater. He sends more strength when the labors increase. To added afflictions, he 
adds mercy. To multiplied trials, he multiplies peace. When we have exhausted our store of endurance, when our strength has failed, the day is half done, when we reach the end of our ordered resources, our Father's full giving is only begun. Fear not that your need shall exceed his provision. Our God ever yearns his resources to share. Lean hard on the arm everlasting, availing the Father both thee and thy Lord will upbear. His love has no limits. His grace has no measure. His power no boundary, known unto men. For out of his infinite riches in Jesus, he gives and gives and gives again the power of his grace. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good night, as it dreams. Same to you, Father. That you do. I believe in love of the cross you're nailed to. I believe in amazing grace and your heaven sent. I believe in you. I believe in. you do. I believe in love of the cross you nailed to. I believe in amazing grace and your heaven sent.